What season is it, Curtis? Hunting season. What season? Deer season. <laughs> Hunting season was right. <laughs> yes, it's deer season. Are you going to get us a deer? I don't know yet. Positive attitude. Are you going to get us a deer? Yeah. <laughs> what do you get if you get a deer? Beef jerky. Wait, deer jerky. Yeah, deer jerky. No, no beef jerky. Hello, YouTube family. I was going to come to you today. I know it's been a while since I've done a video. There's been a whole bunch going on and um, and I just honestly didn't have the energy. Um, Hunter had gotten a car wreck and totaled his vehicle. He's fine. I'll do a video on that uh, to come. And um, But I did want to tell you that sometimes you see humankind and you're proud to be a human and then sometimes you are just <laughs> disgusted with how people are um, coming to the house the other night <clears throat> there were a litter of kittens in the middle of the road like somebody had dumped them in the road they were scared huddled there and he went by them and then when he came back they were still in the same spot um, so someone had literally just dumped them uh, he gathered them up and so look what we have now and um, we don't need them they will have to find new homes it's not all about feed it's about when you take on the responsibility of another life then you take on that responsibility vet bills and all and um, we don't have <laughs> we can't do anymore right now so uh anyway but look at them there they are there's two of them anyway that <laughs> one's almost camouflaged kiki 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 people are so cruel Yeah, they're wetting. We let them out of the garage today to go exploring. She has two different color eyes. On another note, it's fall. It's beautiful weather. This is my favorite time of the year. Um, spring is next, where I can see the new growth. Hey, Slick. And, uh, but I do seriously love fall. I love the colors. I love fall. I love the weather. It cooling off. Today does not feel very cool. Last night was really cool. But um, I had long sleeves on this morning. And I now have shorts and a t-shirt on. It is about time to winterize. Let me turn this around. To winterize coops. This one we... Uh, summarized I don't know why. but for warmer weather we took the tarp up um, so we're gonna have to have one that goes all the way to the ground again to give them some warm air ready to put hay in our chicken coop for the nest boxes because um, straw has been a little bit hard to find hopefully I can find some um, soon because it works way better than hay but for now, it is hay time. It'll be wood cutting time before long. The speckled chickens are looking great. They're full grown now. I'll be expecting eggs any time. I will have to get some nest boxes, I guess, if I want to expect that. Um, but I just love the way my flock looks. There's what, two, four, six, eight, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, I have two somewhere else. They might have gone out. Anyway, so uh, so they're doing good. Look how big that rooster is. It's a nice size. Pretty hens. I really do. I really do like these birds. As you can see, we have taken the tarp off the hoop coop. It was torn on the sides where the goats got into it. Uh, we finished covering it. Actually, Hunter did that. Finished covering it on this section. You can tell from the top. I had to go above the board on that section. 
but uh, with chicken wire since the tarp is off and we'll be covering it and making it winter safe before long these roosters are so pretty it's gonna be a shame to eat them but three have got to go with the price of feed oh my gosh the price of eggs I was at Brahms last night and said a uh, a chain mainly in Oklahoma uh, that has their own dairy and or a fast food restaurant and um, ice cream and and they have a, a small store with produce um, and all their own dairy stuff it's the, their milks all a2 a2 um, I really like their butter if you're a butter connoisseur and can taste the difference in butter next to the grass-fed butter it is the best butter um, in my opinion anyway um, was in there and their eggs they're a little bit higher than say Walmart on eggs uh, generally but not not enough to make a trip um, but one dozen one dozen eggs last night while I was there five dollars and 29 cents over five bucks for one dozen eggs one that just blows my mind eggs used to be the cheap protein you know um not so much uh anyway that was that that was scary my girls better start laying my uh speckled um sussex have not started laying yet but i expect eggs anytime as much as feed costs they better hurry up and give me some eggs um it's fall look at look at this grass guys it's all the bare spot is where grass was and then all that out there that's just all weeds that's all um yeah just dry crispy weeds so i was just touching base with you i also want to talk to you i might make a separate video um or maybe a live because i want feedback on um on tapping have any of you tapped your own trees I'm not talking about like like someone who does that for part of their living or has a whole bunch of trees but I've recently been looking into it and um, it seems as if any maple you can tap I have five huge maples in my yard um, in the front part of my property anyway uh, and I am seriously considering that and so I want some feedback so I might do a live before long asking about that and seeing if you guys have any insight um, anyway on the goats um, this little one right here Dolly's baby we have decided to go ahead and keep we're gonna let um, one of Lori's bucks from LG Homestead breed her if she's bred she can't accidentally get bred by a different buck um, and her name she's the sweetest goat oh, not you <laughs> okay all of them are sweet goats yes you're all you're all good babies yeah um but my mama suggested we kept calling her dolly's baby and she says why don't you just call her baby doll so for right now she just has a i guess a herd name a, a baby doll um until i settle on one which has been really hard for me and i don't know why She's a sweet girl. Yes, you're all sweet girls. And Dory, she best get bred this year. She might have to find a pet home. And this will be, this is a Zora. It'll be her first year to be bred. Of course, not you. That's a Shelly. She's a seasoned goat. She's like five, I guess. Yeah, and then Kai, you're seasoned too, huh? Yeah. And then this will be her second freshening. She produced such beautiful babies and was so easy to milk. So, whereas I thought I was going to get rid of my my uh, mixed goats, she has proven to be awesome on the milk stand. Produces well. So she gets to stay. Let's see, she just comes up for pets. She's so soft. Are you so soft, huh? Are you so soft? 
Yeah, she makes it hard to get rid of her. <sighs> Someone's jealous. You're so jealous? Yeah. So I wanted to thin my hair down a little bit. You know, uh, not the way it was, but, well, and actually I kept one. So it's not thinned down at so all. For future reference, in case I ask, when did I start feeding hay? Last year, in 2022, I started feeding hay <laughs> October 15th. Way too early, but that is, um, that's how it has to be because you can see there is nothing out there for him to eat. Just, just nothing. Guys like that? Huh? You like that? Necessary part. But we're going to use the litter out of the... Um, yeah, what was that chicken coop? For the garden bed. Break it all up. And now some of the hay for the horses. I've been waiting. They're gonna be happy to get it. Are you ready for some? Are you ready for some hay? Oh, see if I can hold that camera. I know, I know, just a second. Just a second, let me throw it up. There you go. Yeah. They're ready for hay too. That grass is all gone out there. Yeah, pretty horses. Horses. We let the chickens out, so they're grazing in some grass and bugs, playing in mud puddles. Look at that girl. Isn't she pretty? If you think chickens are pretty, um, about three decades decades ago, I would have never imagined myself saying a chicken was pretty. I actually didn't even like chickens. Yeah, times change. And there's the boys we won't get too close to because they stink. Well, um, <laughs> the brown one there, Ray, actually peed on Sean the other day. He came in a bit mortified and um, had to change and wash as well as he could before he caught the bus for school. It was great. So we no longer feed them in the morning. They get afternoon feeding because um, cause Ray was naughty. You were naughty. Yeah, you were. You beat on Sean. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you and hope that you have a very wonderful week this week. Um, soak up God's blessings and his grace. Thank you so much.